Hello guys, welcome to Football Manager 2020. Today we are in Croatia and we are going to check Croatian first league. So we are going to see the best players in this league, wonder kids who are playing in this league, the best team and the worst team. So let's start from the best players of each team. So we are going to start from Dinamo Zagreb and their best player is Dominic Livakovic, a really fantastic goalkeeper with a current ability 144. Uh, he has really great attributes, especially one-on-ones, uh, great reflexes. But there is the Dani Olmo, and that's really weird, because Dani Olmo is really the best player in this league. That's my opinion. Dani Olmo has a current ability of 141, but incredible potential ability, 169. Okay, next club is Gorica. The best player is uh, Christian Kaklinja, Croatian goalkeeper with a current ability 119. Okay, then we are going to check Hajduka. Best player is uh, Mio Caktas, uh, attacking mister with some really great free kick taking, great technique. Uh, current ability 131. Rijeka, the best player is Alexander Gorgon, uh, Austrian, uh, Austrian winger, uh, inside forward, can play on both sides, uh, really nice physical attributes, uh, good technical attributes. His current ability is uh, 129. Next club is Inter Zaprešić. The best player is Borislav Tsonev, a Bulgarian playmaker. Okay, his current ability is 115. Istra. Uh, the best player is Sergi, a Spanish wing back, 24 years old. His current ability is uh, 115. Actually, he's on loan from Alaves. Then we have uh, Lokomotiva. Uh, their best player is uh, Mirtu Zumi, Albanian uh, winger uh, or inside forward, 24 years old, incredible natural fitness, uh, current ability is uh, 119. Osijek, their best player is Miles Koric, uh, Croatian uh, midfielder DM with the current ability 130. Uh, he can play as a central defender too, really interesting player. Then we have Slaven Belupo. Uh, their best player is uh, Ko Minga Jin Mezala, South Korean Mezala, uh, with a current ability 115. Okay, next club is uh, Varaždin. Their best player is Leon Benko. Uh, he's 35 years old striker, current ability 117. Okay, now we are going to check the best wonder kids in this league. And first is Dani Olmo, Spanish attacking mister. We spoke about him. He has incredible potential ability. Uh, 169. Already some great technical attributes like dribbling, first touch, uh, flair, balance, uh, off the ball, fantastic movement. Okay, now let's check the number two. Second is Nicola Mor, also playing for Dinamo Zagreb. Really great deep line playmaker uh, with a potential ability uh, 154. Then we have Tonio Teklić, uh, only 19 years old shadow striker who is playing for Hajduk. His potential ability is uh, 138. Uh, uh, next on my list is uh, Mihail Zaper, advanced playmaker playing for Osijek. Price between 2 and 4 million. Uh, his potential ability is uh, 148. Okay, then we have Boško Šutalo, Croatian wing back, back playing for Osijek uh, with a potential ability uh, 154. Next player is Denis Bušnja. Uh, he's playing for Rijeka. Uh, actually, he's on loan from Rijeka, playing for Istra. Really great winger, price between 1 and 3 million. His potential ability is 139. Mario Vušković, uh, Croatian central defender, only 17 years old, playing for Hajduk, uh, with a potential ability 137. Then we have uh, Noel Bilic, uh, 16 years old advanced forward, also playing for Rijeka. You just need to pay compensation of around 500,000, that's really nothing. Uh, his potential ability is uh, 139. And uh, last on my list is Marin Kuzminski, Croatian Mezala playing for Osijek, price between 250,000 and 575,000, uh, his potential ability is 146. And if you want to play in this league, uh, the easiest way to win the title is to choose Dinamo Zagreb, so Dinamo Zagreb is the best club in this league. Uh, now let's check uh, club uh, finances. 
Uh, we see that transfer budget is uh, seven around eight million. Wage budget uh, two hundred two thousand. That's not so bad. Facilities and um, nice stadium capacity around thirty five thousand. Training facilities fourteen. Youth facilities fourteen. Junior coaching seventeen. Youth recruitment twenty. And corporate facilities only three. Now let's see the worst club in this league. And if you want the hardest challenge, then you need to choose the Inter Zaprosic. So, this is probably the worst uh, club in this league. Uh, now let's check finances. Uh, we see they have uh, only 79,000 uh, transfer budget, wage budget only 13,000. Facilities, uh, stadium, a uh, small stadium around 5,000. Training facilities only 9, youth facilities 10, junior coaching 12, youth recruitment 10, and corporate facilities only 2. Okay guys, so this was my short overview over Croatian First League. I really hope that you enjoyed watching this video. And if you did, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. See you and bye bye.